It's important to showcase your fish in the best possible way. And one of the easiest ways to achieve this is to ensure that the inside of the glass is free of algae. This aquarium has a large amount of fish and it's under a sunroof so it gets a lot of algae. And as you can see the green algae grows very quickly. What's great is that the fish are able to eat it so all you have to do is get rid of it and the fish will do the rest. What we're using here is the Mag Float Large Scraper so it can deal with glass thickness up to 19mm. And what's really great about this particular model is that it has a blade scraper attachment. So what I'm doing is just with a bit of downward pressure I scrape all the algae away and basically it's using the blade to remove it. Now this is a really important factor to consider. Quite often in our aquariums we utilize sand or, or gravel that's got a large amount of iron in it. What that does it becomes magnetized to the magnet. So this scraper, because there's always a gap between where the magnetized section and the point of contact is, the sand doesn't automatically just group onto the scraper. One really important factor of this is to always make sure that the, the actual scraper is lubricated. So as you can see, all I'm doing is I'm taking a bit of water, put it on, I scrape it all the way down, and then I remove the, the magnetized scraper and that allows it to ascend. And in that time, all the sand and debris that might have been collecting within the blade falls away. And what's quite good about this is that it, you lower the chance of you scraping the glass because that's the one thing that we don't want to happen. And that's why we're using this mag float which has got the scraper so we're not picking up all the dirt. With the coral sand it doesn't really magnetize to it but with other sand it is. As you can see we're just moving back and forth getting rid of all of that algae, turning it into a pristine aquarium that it should be as well as giving your fish a nice snack. Now mag float is the brand that we use it's the, probably the only one that I'd, I'd recommend. I've tried a lot of them. This is the only one that has the power of strength and magnet to make sure that it's always there. If you drop it, it floats to the surface. And, of course, it comes with that lovely attachment of the scraper, which just dropped your workload so much. Um, you don't actually have to get in there and manually scrape the corners, which I think is the number one bane of my existence. As you can see, this aquarium is well on its way to looking as good as it can. The fish are happy, healthy, vibrant. They're getting a bit of a snack right now. And my job's going to be done. It's almost time to have a beer and just check it out. Creating natural looking aquariums that are easy to maintain.